Hey guys, so I got a, you know, a guy here that was, you know, complaining at me and now he did unsubscribe Just because I made a video where he didn't agree and I'm sorry, but we don't agree in all the things That's why I'm making videos to share my opinions so you guys also could share your opinions And some people doesn't really seems to be able to, you know, get that other people have other opinions about stuff and basically this guy, he said here on my little channel page, I did subscribe to this user, but this pathetic attempt to compare iPhone 4S with Galaxy S2, I have withdrawn. Okay, so what, what was really the pathetic thing with comparing the iPhone 4S with the Galaxy S2 with things that we already, with specs that we already know about these devices? And also, the iPhone 4S it doesn't come with a new design, so we do know the form factor exactly and everything, how it's gonna be, okay? It's not like a new design or anything or secret. I was just comparing things that we already knew, like the the camera it was going to have and all of those things. So, wh what was wh what did I do wrong? Did you have anything that you think that I was saying wrong or something? You can you know just go ahead and comment about that so I I know that to the next time. And then he basically said calling the phone Sammy and saying it's faster it's a uh, with the better battery life before release is just blatant bias okay so just because I'm calling the Samsung Galaxy S2 for Sammy then he don't like that so he unsubscribed uh, saying it's faster etc with uh, did I say it was faster because I think that they have like these like almost the same speed because the CPU seems to be the same that uh, uh, Cortex RM RM not Cortex A9 RM, RM, I don't, I don't remember, but Cortex something, RM, uh, it seems like it's like the same processor, uh, but the, the the one that is in the Galaxy S2 is basically the higher clocked, but you should remember that it's like all about the software, how it works with the hardware, so it seems like uh, the 3D rendering stuff like that, it's much better on the iPhone 4S, uh, because it have that like IP2 GPU that really like killed the Galaxy S2 and other tons of other phones in a benchmarking test, uh, but uh, yeah, it's gonna be interesting to see a, a comparison with the GPU on iPhone 4S with the, like the Samsung Galaxy S2 and other Android phones out there. Uh, but it definitely seems like the 3D stuff uh, is gonna be better on the iPhone 4S. I don't say anything about that. Better battery life. Yes, we do know that because they showed off the standby time and everything. So, you know, obviously we can compare the battery life when we have the official stuff from an event from Apple. Um, like life before release so you know that you think that the standby time and stuff at, at Apple have wrong with the things that they have tried out with the mobile uh, because really the standby time on the iPhone, iPhone 4 was 300 hours now on the iPhone 4s it's 200 hours and that seems like a big big fail but obviously let's use the standby time but still I have a Galaxy S2 by the way but this but don't want to see pathetic guess work like this did I guess no I had like statistics I had both like two sites up and running with the specs that we officially know oh my god that's not guess but if you have anything anything that I say wrong or something you can you know go ahead and let me know in a comment if you don't say something that then, then I don't know I mean people have to say their own opinions as well so yeah random I'm so I'm sorry but I don't know what's wrong with the video I was doing uh, because I you know just went from the real things that we already do know and it's gonna be fun to see some real stuff when the iPhone 4 finally or iPhone 4s I always forget that s that iPhone 4 suck iPhone uh, that what that stands for or maybe speed I don't know well yeah uh, but uh, as you could hear I, I don't like the, the, the iPhone 4s I mean it's a it's a good phone but I don't like that Apple doesn't give you like an option uh, between like a bigger screen or a smaller screen I think that 3.5 I want to hear your guys' opinions about this. Do you think a 3.5 inch screen is big, or do you think it's small, or do you want the bigger one? Do you think that this is a big fail? At least I do believe so. And if you do comment about that, then you have to let me know. Have you used like a 3.5 inch screen before for like a year? Because I've been using the, my iPad Touch 3G for like a year, and I've been you know surfing the web a lot, browsing and stuff like that. And I, I gotta tell you, I want the bigger screen, okay? I, that the hyper touch that I was using it well, they came out like 2009 and they and Apple still are not giving you an option to the guys that want the bigger screen and I also think they have said sometime that uh, you don't need a bigger screen blah 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 
I mean seriously if <laughs> if I want like a little bigger screen then I have to go to buy an iPad and I can't have an iPad in my pocket it, it's just a big fail so let, just let me guys know do you think 3.5 is too small I think at least that Apple you know usually Apple is uh, not behind all of the guys usually they launch some sick stuff and yes the camera on iPhone 4s I think it's a little better uh, than the one right now on the Galaxy S2, but we should remember the Galaxy S2 is, is not like an extremely new phone, it's been out for like six months. So, whatever you know, Sam is doing right now, then they probably have some you know other badass things going on. They, they always feels like Samsung is always trying to you know have the best uh, technology out there in their devices and. Uh, also, so also Apple is obviously famous for you know being first with stuff, but this time they weren't really first. And also they are pretty famous with their like redesigns and that they're finished and everything. Now they haven't the finished like smartphone out, and it's not even like close to the Galaxy S2 in uh, you know thickness, uh, or maybe it is. Maybe you think it is. I don't think it is. And uh, yeah, and it's behind the screen size and everything. It's just. It's just a big fail, okay? A big fail, but what do you think about screen size? Please let me know. See you.